Hey guys! So I know I was supposed to post a video on Monday, but bad storms and I also wasn't allowed to film in the hospital. The hospital? You say? Why would I need to film in the hospital? <laughs> Maybe because me and Courtney are having a baby? Maybe that's the reason why. Yes, it is. We are having a baby! And I'm so excited. It's so crazy. It still doesn't feel real even though I saw the baby on Monday. I'm uploading this on Thanksgiving, so today's Wednesday and so I'll be uploading this tomorrow. This week has been crazy and I haven't been able to post a video because the connection has been really crappy and if I would have uploaded a video, it would have taken like five hours to upload it and it takes forever and we still wanted to use a computer, we wanted to use Netflix, so I was like, it's not worth it to wait five hours to post a video. And it looks like the weather is a lot better today and the connection has been a lot quicker, so I'll be uploading it on Thanksgiving, which will be kind of fun. And yeah, so anyways, I am 11 weeks, two days now. I had my appointment on Monday, so I was 10 weeks, six days on Monday. And I thought I was nine weeks, six days on Monday. So I'm really a week farther than I thought which is so exciting and that pushes my date now to June 14th instead of June whatever, I can't calculate that. Anyways, yeah, I was supposed to be farther and um, so now I get to have the baby at June 14th which is so exciting and if you guys know me, you know I'm really short and I've got a really small torso. I am totally already showing like a little bit which is really funny because my torso is so small and normally people don't even show until like 16 weeks so I'm kind of an early bloomer so I'll have to give you guys a belly shot at the end of my video but I definitely thought I needed to post this video because I wanted to get, tell you guys even though I know most of my subscribers are on my Facebook and Instagram so they already know that I'm pregnant but I thought I would still post a video and not leave the ones hanging that do subscribe to me and don't have me on Instagram and Facebook, which you guys are more than welcome to follow me. <laughs> um, yeah, so there's that. I'm gonna pull out my phone really quick because I wanna tell you guys, give you guys like a, a little pregnancy update. If you guys think that's pretty cool, you know. So I have two apps. I have Glow Nature. Oh my gosh, let me get the camera situated. I have two apps. I have one app called Glow Nature and then I have one app called The Bump. And I like reading The Bump when I have like a pregnancy update. So the baby is the size of a lime. Oh my gosh, a little lime. And it's 0.25 ounces and it's 1.6 inches long. So it says your baby is as big as a lime. You can't see it, but baby is moving uh, fluidly and gracefully in there. Baby's skin is see-through, but is on his or her way to be looking to looking more like a baby. Sorry, I don't have my glasses on, so I can't read very well. Baby's fingers and toes aren't webbed anymore. Tooth buds are and hair follicles and nail beds are forming. Your fetus is about yeah. I already told you how big it is, and then it says around 11 weeks you'll probably notice some subtle changes like an increase in, okay that's gross, vaginal discharge and dark vertical line appearing down the center of your belly known as the linea nigra. Yeah, I've noticed that. I noticed that a few days ago and I was like, oh my gosh, I think I'm too early to be showing that, but I think it's because my torso is so small, like I already said, so I'm kind of like already showing it a little bit. It's pretty much saying like, hey, you and your husband need to get a romantic baby moon getaway before the baby comes. And then it says, pregnancy symptoms of 11 weeks. Fatigue and nausea. Don't worry, you should start to feel more like yourself soon. Fatigue and nausea have been so bad for me. I don't know how you guys have felt during your pregnancies, but this is my first, obviously, and I have felt so sick. I have, I've maybe gone now three days without throwing up, and that has been a goal for me like it's been awesome and I've been so 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 stinking sick I was in the emergency room last week they had to give me fluids because I had thrown up so much in a span of like 24 hours that they had to put fluids in me and because I was so dehydrated it was just not fun at all and I didn't feel well at all but once I put the fluids in me my headache went away and I had my appetite a little bit better but I still haven't had like a crazy appetite and 
but I guess I still am craving a couple things like Flaming Hot Cheetos, which is really bad. And I've been craving um, Panda Express and I've been craving mozzarella sticks. And I've been burping a lot. So it says gas, <laughs> like farting and burping. That's funny, that's on the list next and I just burp. Yeah, I'm like full of farts and I'm full of burps. So that's, that's my life. My poor husband has to deal with farts and, and burps. So mood swings, yeah, I've been really moody. But I have been trying to go to the gym. It's been hard because the weather's been so bad. Sorry, I'm like totally reading off my phone. Okay, and then leg cramps. I haven't noticed any leg cramps. A dark line on your belly. Yeah, I already said that. So that's pretty much all the symptoms. But I've been sick. Started, I was started getting sick like week six. And it's starting to settle down, I noticed, these past like three days. And the doctor had given me some vitamin B6, so that's been helping me a lot. And to get me some stool softener because I have been really constipated. <laughs> but it changed a little bit these past three days, so I've been feeling a lot better. And yeah, so I should next week I'll be hitting my second trimester. Oh my gosh, and people say that you start to feel amazing in your second trimester. Hopefully, that goes well for me. And I guess that's pretty much it. I felt like this today was gonna be just kinda like a pregnancy update and just like let you guys know that I'm pregnant. I guess because I didn't post my video on Monday. I'm really sad that Courtney couldn't be in this video, but I definitely wanted to get this video up and tell you guys that I am pregnant and I have a cute little baby growing inside of me. And, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh, and the heartbeat is 165. So tell me if you think it's a boy or a girl. I don't know, I have a feeling that it's a boy. I do, I definitely have a feeling that it's a boy. Anyways, I've been rambling and I'm already at seven minutes. So I'm gonna end this video with a quick belly shot and then you'll be on your way.